ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತಬಿಂದು ಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಸಹೋದಿತ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದಿ ರಾಧಿಕಾಚರಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನೋ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದಾವನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಛಾಕಲ್ಪತರು ವಶ್ಯ ಕಿಪಾ ಸಿಂಧುಭ್ಯವಚ ಪತಿತನ ಪಾವನೆಭ್ಯ ವೈಷ್ಣವೀಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮೂಕಂ ಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂ ಪಂಗುಂಗ್ಲಂ ಹೈತಿಗಿರಿ ಯತ್ ಕಿಪಾತಮಹಂಗ ವಂದೆ ಪರಮಾನಂದಮಾಧವ ಬೃಂದಾವೈ ತುಳಸಿದೇ ವೈ ಪಿಯಾ ವೈ ಕೇಶವಸ್ವಚ ಕೃಷ್ಣಭಕ್ತಿಪದೆ ದೇವಿ ಸತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರುಂಚೈವ ನರೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವಿ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪಾತ್ರಶ್ಯ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರು ಭಕ್ತಿ ಜುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದ್ವರನ್ ಧೈಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನಮಿಷ್ಟೂಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವಿರಿಂಚನು ತರಣ್ಯ ವೇತ್ತಾತ್ಯಹಂ ಪನುತಪಾಲ್ಯಭವಾಧಿಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷತೆ ಚರಣಿಂದ ಯತ್ಪಾದಪಲ್ಲವನ ಕಚಂದಮನಿ ಛಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರಜೀತ ಕಿಮಿ ಕಪೋದೂಷ್ವದರ್ಶಿ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಾಗ್ರಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮಯಿ ಕದಾ ಕಿಪಾಂಕರ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭುನೀತ್ಯನಂದ ಶಿವಾದ್ವೈತ ಗಧಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಶಿವಾದ್ವೈತ ಗಧಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ಆಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನಕಾಬುದಾತ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈಕರ ಕಮಲಾಯುತಾಕ್ಷ ವಿಶಾಂಬರೌ ದ್ವಿಜವರೌ ಜುಗಧರ್ಮಪಾಲೌ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾಪಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೆ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಾಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿ ದೀಪರೂಪ ಭುಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಾಸಿ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇನ್ನ ಸದಾ ನರಾನ ಗಂಗಾತರಮನೀಯಜಟಾಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭುಷಿ ತ್ವಾಮ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಮನಂಗ ಮದಾಪಹಾರ ವರಾನುಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವಿಶ್ವನಾಥ ಬಾಗೀಶಜುಷ್ವದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀರ್ಜಶ ಚಕ್ಷಸಿ ಯಸ್ತೆ ಹೃದಯ ಸಂಬಿಹಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜಿ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 
राम राम हरे यक्षक्त बदताम बदिताम वै विवाद संवाद हो भवंती कुरवंत चैषा मुहुरात्म तस्म नमानंत गुणाय भुवने यशक्त वदता बदिना वै विवाद संवाद भुवो भवंती कुरवंत चैषा मुहुरात्म तस्म नमानंत गुणाय भुवने गौरी गोष्ठीपति शिशिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभु पहाँ परमंस जगत गुरु टोल्ड दैट स्निग्ध शिष्य सिंटम ऑफ स्निग्ध शिष्य इज दैट ऑल द क्वालिटीज ऑफ गुरु पाद पद्म यू कैन फाइंड इन एप्लाइड फॉर्म इन द लाइफ ऑफ द डिसाइपल It is called actually snigdo shishya. Gauriya Goshti Bhuti, Sri Sri Lal Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami Jagat Bhopal, Paramahansa Jagat Guru said that that the symptom of snigdo shishya is this: all the qualities of Guru Pad Padma you can find in applied form in the life of that disciple. Then you can realize the snigdo shishya. All Siddhanta Vichars, all etiquette, purity, whatever, all you can find in applied form in the life of that disciple, then you can say that he is Sig Sig the Shishya. Because in Simad Bhagwaji Mahapran, Bhagwan Sri Krishna speaking, Sig the Shishya Shishya Shogura Va Uyham Api Uto. स्निग्ध शिष्य स्निग्ध शिष्य गुरव गुह्यम अपी उत देर इज नथिंग देर इज नथिंग सच सिक्रेस सिक्रेसी हुईच गुरुपाद पद्म कैन नॉट स्पीक इन फ्रंट ऑफ दैट स्निग्ध शिष्य देर इज नो सच सिक्रेट थिंग आई मीन ऑल सिक्रेटी Guru Pad Padma can unveil in front of that Snigdo Shishya. All Sadguru in his life always like to see one such disciple to come in his life. All Snigdo, all Guru Pad Padma Sadguru, those who are all Sadguru. They desire this kind of such disciple can come. Man, a guru can come in my life in the form of disciple who can catch all everything from me. I mean, whatever I have in my in my heart, according to my guru kipa, guru parampara, whatever I have inside heart, I like to keep all this property inside the heart of my disciple. Be sure it is a it is a desire of Sadguru. Always remember it is the desire of Sadguru to put all the treasure whatever he has he like to put inside the heart of the disciple. But usually this kind of disciple is very really rare, really rare. Like Papa speaking. When we can harmonize our heart with Krishna, then we can become happy. Why? Because Bhagwan Sri Krishna always warned, "I am playing on fruits. This Bhangshit Dhani, I want somebody who can harmonize totally. I mean, if he is not going to break the rhythm, then I am very very happy." But usually we are breaking the rhythm. One song, somebody is singing one song, kirtan. Practical example. 
Thakur Das Babaji Maharaj is a disciple of Prabhupada. He used to do Arati Kirtan at the time of Arati. One Brahmachari, without realizing, is going to bell the braille. And he is going to break the rhythm. Finally, Babaji Maharaj becomes very upset. He wants to throw the stick to the boy. Rascal. He throw because you think he becomes angry. Why? You don't understand. Simati Radharani cannot excuse you if you are going to make a blunder mistake in Vrindavan. That's why we are seeking place in Navadip Dham. Any mistake there. Radharani cannot because it is because it's a question of satisfaction of Samson or my heart. I cannot excuse you. That's why it is far better to take shelter here in Navadividham. So Go Nithananda can excuse us. Okay, no problem. You cannot believe at the time of Gaur Nithananda's Prakat Leela, when they were doing Leela. In that case, there was no question of Aparad. There used to be free distribution. You cannot believe. Free distribution. No, okay, Aparad, no. But at present, we have to think about Dasavida, Nambara, everything. When they were there doing Leela, everywhere, take, 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 everywhere. Gaur Nityananda now. So, so Thakur Das Baba was angry. Why? Because the boy making disturbance in spite of repeated warning. In spite of repeated warning already given. Now still he is going to make mistake. So he is going to make disturbance in my seva. Kirtan seva. Is a question of satisfaction of Radha Govindo. Like you can find, actually, you cannot realize in Radha Govindo Leela, Lalita, Vishaka, all Sakhi, Vrindadevi, very punctual all the time. If anybody making some mistake, they become, they are looking at them. Looking at them this way, try to rectify. You don't know. They are very punctual, very punctual about their seva and about the quality of absolute quality. They like to maintain, they like to maintain all absolute quality. That's why they are not talking. They are not talking in Nishanta Leela. Vrindadevi only giving gesture to Kakati or the birds, they start singing song. They are not talking. Very silent. Because Radha Govinda is a question of Seva. So if you make any mistake there in Vrindavan Dham, that's why in Gaur, though we know Gaur Dham and Vrindavan Dham all same, but still is very so, it is the desire of Guru Pad Padma that I, la I like to see one such disciple, I mean Guru, so that I can fit all my treasure inside his heart. Even Krishna, suppose one song going on, one song going on, if you break the rhythm, then the song is disturbed. So the Bhagavan Sri Krishna playing on the fluids, we will have to keep track with him. This is called bhajan. You don't understand. There is the secret meaning you can realize when you can get maturity in your bhajan. Finally. Finally, when you can get maturity, you can find, oh, there is one Bhangshit Dhani going on. So we will have to set read. Prabhupada used to Baba always used, used this word, set read. You have to be very careful, there should not be any disturbance. So, 
we all our activity, everything should be harmonized in such a way so that it not it, it it not become a disturbance for Krishna. I mean always we should. This way all our Guru Bharga, they are all going to maintain the same rhythm. All Guru Bharga, Siddhar Gusima, Bhakti Bhant Purisha, Kesha Gus. They are all totally harmonized with Guru Padpada. All. That's the same rhythm. What Prabhupada wanted to do, I try to play the music this way. So this way they are playing. And some Guru Bharga, so-called Guru Bharga, they are going to break, break the rhythm. They are scattered, get lost. They are not actually our Guru Bharga because they are going to meet, make uh, aparad and to a lotus feet of. Anyway, this is the actual uh, Siddhanta Visha. So, without realizing Adhyay Gyan Tattva, first of all, point coming, Adhyay Gyan Tattva. Without realizing the Adhyay Gyan Tattva, you have no right to go anywhere. Propitiating this and no, nothing. Because so long, even so long as you are not established in Adhyay Tattva, it is 100% inevitable, you can make mistake. Hundred percent you can make mistake. You can go in preaching and you can see beautiful girl or you can see very rich man, their house, you can see. Those who are completely established in Adhyagan Tattva, only and only they can go for preaching. And those who are established in Adhyagan Tattva, surely they are enjoying full kipa of Guru Patpat. Without that, not possible. Without ki, Guru Kipa, not possible. Because restlessness, always there inside heart. How you can, how you can go out of that? First question. So, for the past few days we are discussing that Bhagavan Sri is now going to advise to Uddhav about about the secret love affair, about the most secret love affair between Brajavasis and Krishna, and mutual love affair. In fact, I already told Bhagavan Sri Krishna cannot bear the shortage there in, Bhagavan Sri Krishna cannot bear the shortage there in Uddhav. What is the shortage? Everything, okay. But, he don't understand the very secret love affair between Brajavasis and Krishna, especially those Brajagopikas and Krishna. That is the reason for why Bhagavan Sri Krishna wanted to send Uddhav to Vrindavandam. That was the very secret reason. And Krishna was success successful because by the desire of Bhagavan Sri Krishna, Uddhavji Maharaj was successful to realize the very secret love affair between Brajavasis and Krishnas. Actually, Krishna wanted to send him as an advisor, but actually, inner meaning is that Bhagavan wanted to arrange some advice to Uddhav by Brajavasis. That was the secret reason. But externally, as a, you can give advice to them so that uh, they can feel relaxed and they are feeling problem inside heart. So, Bhagavan Sikh is not speaking. The, even when I was there in Vrindavan Dham, when I was there in Vrindavan Dham, I used to go to posturing field they, they, it was the situation, they could not bear even a fraction of second uh, viraha, kriti yugaya, fraction of second. When I am going to posturing field, each and every fraction of second they are thinking like Brahma Ratra, oh! And during Rasa Leela, Duration of Rasa Leela was 
Brahmaratya, throughout Brahmaratya total, if you calculate, you can go mad. But still, it was the feeling of those gopikas that within fraction of second, all, uh, all finished, all gone. Within the twinkling of eyes, all gone. How so quickly? So you understand. That's when they are lost, they get lost in Krishna. That is the reason. So Krishna speaking, Tasta khapaha presto tameno nita mayaivo brindavana gochareno chanardabata punarango tasam hina maya kalpo samabhubu. Now I come to Mathura. Now I come to Mathura. I mean, I am taken to Mathura. And there, each and every fraction of second, they think like yoga. Big time not going. Bhagavan Sri Krishna, I already told yesterday, Bhagavan Sri Krishna giving one nice example. Like all rivers having their different sources from where they are coming out and flowing through different places and finally they are going to meet with the ocean. And whenever they are going to meet with the ocean, they are all going to leave their respective identity. It's quite natural. So long it was Swaraswati, it was Mandakini, Alakananda, Bhagirati, all different names. Oh, is is. But finally, what happens? Finally, they are going to lose all their identity. Same example, Bhagavan Sikh is not speaking to Uddhav. Uddhav, Krishna is the ocean of beauty, ocean of everything. Krishna is the ocean of Madhurja. Bhagavan Chaitanya Mahaprabhu wanted to uh, wanted to give one example to Rupa Goswami Pad. Rupa, actually, I am going to give you one drop of that nectarian test. I wanted to give you one drop of nectarian test. Just say you how tasty. Actually, Krishna is the infinity ocean of beauty, everything. Who am I to explain about Krishna to you? Someday if you can realize, someday if you can discover that you are in, someday if you can discover yourself in the ocean of Krishna's, you know, rasa, then you can realize. Otherwise, any amount of lecture, philosophy is, is not possible. Is a question of practical feeling. Is a question of practical feeling, Uthab. So, those gopikas, they get lost in me. They get lost in me. Uthab, I am source of all Aisharjo. You know, na? Aisharjo, Samagya, Sabirjo, Jaso, Sriyo, Gyan, Vairagya, Iti, Saro. Iti bhaga ingana. I am the source of all Aishadyo, everything. But they are not concentrating in my this Aishadyo. They are less interested. Only they are feeling my Madhurjo. If somebody is going to claim that in Vrindavan there is no Aishadyo, he is foolish number one. In Vrindavan, Aishadyo there. Sri Chaitanya Mahapur told to Sivas Pandit, you can remember, there was some discussion between Sivas Pandit and Sarup Gosai at oh, Purushottam Dham, Nilachal Khetra Purushottam Dham, Hera Panchami Day, Hera Panchami Day. Lakshmi Devi is supposed to come and beat all the servants of Jagannath. Why you? You bring up, you bring my Prabhu right now. 
I don't like to hear any argument. Where is the problem? Lakshmi Devi beating the servants of Krishna. That's very beautiful, Leela. This is going on. And uh, Lakshmi Devi is supposed to come. In the meantime, the discourse going on. Very nice discussion. Our Sivas Pandit giving argument. Lakshmi Devi is the goddess of riches. Oh, infinity. I Sarja Deya. Oh, your, your Radharani. What? What I Sarja Deya? Eh? Nothing. Is a coward girl. Nothing there. Eh? Eh? Then Mahaprabhu laughing and speaking. Sivas, actually you are the Vaikuntha Parsha. So you understand this Vaikuntha Aishwarya. But you forget. But you forget. In the one corner, in the, at, the, at any corner of Bindavan, all the Aishwarya of Vaikuntha can be accommodated. Oh, still you cannot compare. So, Mahaprabhu giving nice argument. Sarup, Sivas, actually Sarup, Iho Hoi Shud, Iho Hoi Shuddha Brajavasi. Actually, Sarup is Siddha Brajavasi, Shuddha Brajavasi. And you are actually from Vaikuntha. So, so Aishwajya is there. Aishwajya not there, not possible. You can remember long ago, I told one incident, perhaps you forget. The king of Delhi, I mean, Akbar Basa came, he used to come to Vrindavan. Usually he used to come sometimes, staying in Vrindavan, and he used to serve some sadhus, you need something, I can give you. This way, Akbar Basa, though is Muslim, the still he used to serve. And sometime Akbar Basa used to take the white base like Babaji's used to say in Bhajan Kuti. He was very enjoying. It is not Bhajan. It's not like uh, I mean imitating. It's still okay. So he is requesting Sanatan Gosai, I like to serve you, please. I have no seva what you can serve now. I like to serve you. Uh, please you know speak. Sanatan Gosai, I have no seva. What seva I can do? No say why? Because those are Niskinchan Sadhu, usually they don't like to take anything any from anybody. Or at all taking like Madhukuri. Okay, if somebody gets yes. But not big amount. Because whenever you are giving big amount, you are feeling that I am giving big, big amount to the sadhu. So Niskinchan Sadhu always taking Madhukuri Fisha. So they are. So Sanatan Gosai repeatedly speaking, I don't need actually king, I have everything but sad. What I can need? Bhav repeatedly speaking. Then Sanatan Gosai to, told, okay, you can repair this uh, staircase that's broken. Staircase, broken. Because Sanatan Gosai. You have gone to that uh, Dadas Adi Tatila in Vrindavan. Dadas Adi Tatila, there is the Mariyan Madan Mahan Mandir. From there, there is one staircase they're coming down into Jamuna. So, Sanatan Gosai used to go there to wash his uh, Boga Patra, I mean utensil, and come back with water for drinking everything. So, he is speaking, this uh, staircase is broken, you can repair. Then Akbar Basa was feeling, it is insulting. Staircase broken? Yes. Then Swanathun was saying, you see the staircase there. Whenever Swanathun was saying, could realize Akbar Basa feeling some false ego. He think it is uh, insulting for him. So whenever Sanatan Gosai is started indicating that is the staircase here, then the Bindavan appear. Bindavan appear. Bindavan is there in hiding form. Then Akbar Basa watching by the indication of Sanatan Gosai, 
when Akbar was, Akbar was watching the staircase, he gone mad. He gone mad totally. He is going to catch the lotus feet of Sanatana and say, it is not possible for me to repair the staircase. Because one one jewel fitted there, fitting there. If I sell my whole kingdom, not possible. So precious jewel. Dibba Ratna. Follow. Dibya Bindaran Nukalpadimad. Chinta Mani Pakara Sadmasukalpa Viksha Yaksha Bidit Bite Susurabi Rabi Palayantam. This kind of sloka there. So Aishwarya is there. Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking to Uddha. They never want any Aishwarya from me. They want nothing from me. They want nothing from me. No Aishwarya, nothing. Only they, they love me, they, they only love me. This is no interest, self-interest. Vajanta navindan mai anushanga vadva dhiyaha sva atmanam atmanam adastedam ethedam yatha samadho manayo adhitaye nadyaha pravishta eva nam rupayo sva atmanam adaha sathedam just like I give example just like I give example, like all the rivers coming and get lost, Uddhav, those gopikas, not thinking about those gopikas, they are not thinking about anything. They are not even in any tension. Like who can speak what? I am coming to meet with Krishna. What people can speak? I am a... So uh, they have their father, mother, husband, or so many things. And there is some social systems are there. There are some social system in our society. If somebody is going to break the social systems, it is not good. We are not, we should not break the social system. What is there? We should not break. So, but gopikas, they are not thinking anything. They are less interested. They are not in tension that somebody can speak something to us. Well, what will happen? Uh, they are not thinking. This way, Bhagavan speaking, they are giving everything, even their body, speech, mind, everything for me. They are giving everything to me. This way, Bhagavan speaking, and that kind of bhava is really rare. So I already told that those gopikas, though I am giving example like money receives, but don't think that money receives they are getting the same target. Money receives they are going to meet with nirvana. They are going to meet with the Brahma, they get lost, Nirvan, and even they cannot remember their body, their existence, they get lost, Nirvan. But Gopikas are not going to get same thing. They are going to meet with Chit Ghananando Krishna, my Saru. Chit Ghananando. What I told in in bhakti, definition of bhakti. Eh? Kle shagni shubhada moksha laguta krit shudur laba shandranando visheshatma sri krishna karsani chod. Shandranando mean? Shand Actually, shandro, this Sanskrit and Bengali word. And if you exactly translate into English, it's called viscosity. Viscosity. But we are going to take the Shandra Ananda Ghani Bhutu Ghani, dense Ananda. This is more practical. Dense Ananda. Follow. Viscosity is the term you find in, you can find in physics. 
if you put this one danda into water, you can find the, the exact the adjacent area where the water is uh, touching the, you know, danda, I mean wooden, has some, some angle making. So, it's a, it's a, so we understand that Sandrananda Visheshatma, Sandrananda Ghanigutu Ananda, dense Ananda. Is Ananda is very concentrated Ananda. This Ananda, Ghanigutu Ananda, they are getting, this they are getting. Now Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking, question can come, they wanted to get me uh, in the form of husband or uh, sub husband upapati you know here sukhdev goswami giving this example biksham rantum manas chakre atma ramo upi ariramat bhagwan sri krishna is atma ram no question that bhagwan sri krishna can enjoy with some mataji's it's not possible. I already told that those gopikas are sarup shakti. Actually, they are eternally present with Krishna. But the arrangement done by Jogomaya is that they think we are going to meet with Krishna for this time. They are eternally present. They are eternally present in Eternanda. But the arrangement done by Yogamaya is such that the, each of them feeling leaving our husband and room a home we are going to meet with Krishna. This is one kind of excellent feeling of rasa. Only this one. That's why Jiva Goswami wanted to establish that they are parakya means sakya. But foolish people they are fighting. That's why Jiva Goswami was not under the guidance of uh, Rupa Goswami was one of them, but not that. Jiva Goswami wanted to speak something. Actually, they are eternally present there. But they are feeling as if they have their home, they have their husband, everything, so they are going to uh, uh, break their rules and regulations and going to meet. Because that can give excellent bumper success in, in the taste of rasa. Taste of rasa can take a new turn. That's why parakya bhavi hai raser ullas. In Chaitanya Chaitamiti reading, parakya bhavi parakya bhavi hai raser ullas. Ullas means overflowing rasa. Because if you are feeling some attraction for something, but some impediments coming. Man, uh, you are feeling irresistible attraction. In that case, impediments you can break and jump and go. These are the rules. That's mean impediments going to increase your tenacity. Incre in this kind of impediments is acting as a catalyst, catalyst, you know, in chemical reaction. To chemical, you are adding reaction. And if you put one catalyst, then reaction can take place nicely. It's called catalyst, accelerate reaction. This is the procedure. Bhakti Murtakur also speaking, Jiva Goswami path, they're all speaking, Vishwanath Chakoti path, that whenever Krishna Leela appears from eternal dham, when Krishna Leela appears from that eternal dham here in the material world, in that case, whatever there, you can find in sthula, as if in material form you can see. There is a husband, not there, there is no husband. There is no kamsa in fine form, only conception. But whenever they are coming here in the material world, it takes a form like material form. Not material, the material form. It is the arrangement of Jogumaya. Gopikas, it is impossible for them to marry. 
No question of marriage. Where, where from the question of marriage coming? But a marriage there. Whenever they appear here, then Jogama arrange the marriage, father, mother, husband, everything, all arrangement, so that it looks like just like us. Rasa is rasa when you are feeling just like human being. Don't understand you. Excellency of rasa depend one depend upon one very fine factor. That whenever you are going to feel, it is just like human being. Why Krishna Lila is so tasty? Why Krishna Lila is so tasty? Narayan Lila is not so tasty. Because Krishna Lila is tasty, because Krishna is playing just like human human boy. That is a Krishna not going to take a whip on this, that I can wheel. No. Just like human. That is why the excellence of Krishna Lila is unprecedented. We cannot imagine. That is the only reason. So whenever Gopikas they are coming, they are coming from eternal babot, but still when they are coming, then all Jogma are going to arrange such situation so that it looks they have their home, village, they have husband, they are married, they have children, nothing there. All arrangement by Yogamaya. That is why when they are feeling, when they are meeting with different kind of impediments, barrier, then the excellency of rasa are going to reach the peak point. Peak point. That is the reason for why. So anyway, Bhagavan Sikh is doing, Though Uddhav, I have all Aisharja in infinity world, in Aprakita and Prakita Jagat, all appliances I have. Eh? Ishwaraha Paramakrishna Satchidananda Vigraha Anadiravi Govinda Sarvakarana Karanam. But still, they, are, they have no desire, nothing from me. They have no expectation from me. It's a miracle. Their love is without any title. Their love is without any reason why they love me. So, now, after that, Bhagavan Sikh, Bhagavan Sikh was speaking, Uddhav, I wanted to give some direct realization because you already been there. Because now, Uddhav hearing the last speech, now, Uddhav hearing the last uh, advice of Krishna. But before you can remember, Uddhav was sent to Brajadam long ago. Uddhav was sent to long ago. But now is the last moment. Krishna now going away from this material world. So, Krishna want to give some reminder so that he cannot forget. Now Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking. Now I am going to speak. Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking. Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking. Matkama Ramanam Jaram Jaram Sarupo Bido Avala Brahmo Mang Param Apuhu Sangyach Chato Sahasrasa. Those Gopikas, they never wanted to think that I am Parabrahma. They never thought, oh, it's Parabrahma, so we need to concentrate. In. They had no idea. Not with, not with the conception that Parabrahma it is our duty, not that. So, Bhagavad Gita, those, those who are feeling tremendous attraction for me, those gopikas, they never knew that I am Brahma. Only like, just like one material heroine going to love material hero, going to sacrifice everything. So, even in material world. What to speak about a Prakita Jagat? In material world, one let one girl 
She is from very rich family, billions of dollars. She is going to develop love affair with one motor mechanics. Motor mechanics. He is doing repairing of <laughs> motorcycles. Can you remember? How possible? That's why our Guru Bhargava used to make one joking. But you don't understand, it's Bengali. Guru Padmani used to make one joking. Jar Sange Bhaji. Jar Sange Maje Mon Kiva Hari Kiva Dom. Guru Padman used to make one joking. If your mind is attached with somebody, be is, is a sweeper or whatever she is, what I need, otherwise I can give my life. Kiva Hari Kiva Dom. Guru Padman used to speak in Bengal. Jar Sange Maje Mon. If you develop love for somebody, you don't care what is the position. I is a is a daughter of a ch chanda, but no, I need that lady. <laughs> this is the condition. Love is material love. So, aprakita love, it looks like material love. Aprakita love, it looks like material love. But aprakita love is totally different. And prakita love, you can, you can confuse. You can confuse, you don't understand. I can give example, I told many times that this material world is a perverted reflection of the transcendental world. You can remember long ago, maybe two, three, four years back I told, so many things I am speaking. So I told, this material world is a perverted reflection of the transcendental world. What is there, there is perverted reflection here. So, in this material world, what is very dirty, that is, if you rectify it from, if you take, that is the most excellent. I mean, the love affair between, between Gopikas and Krishna is the topmost excellence in the in, in, in infinity universe. Whereas, same, love affair between a man and woman, hero and hero in the material world, is one very, you should decry, hate. Ah, you say this, yeah. Because the perverted reflection, you are in confusion. So, if you find one plum tree here, plum tree here at the bank of one lake, one plum tree at the bank of one lake, the plum tree, if you watch, that the plum tree, if you watch, that the, this head portion, if you look down, head portion is just opposite. This plum tree, you can find one image there in the water. What you can see? Just perverted. I mean, you can see the root is just adjacent to the water, adjacent, and the top is far down. Upper portion is up, but you can see just opposite, it's just down. More and more down, you can see just the tree, just opposite, you can find. Follow what I say. Head portion is up, but here in water, it seems it is down. That's been perverted. So, what is excellent in that Aprakita Dham, Parakya Baba, what is most excellent objective? Impossible to explain. So nice. And that is very bad here in the material world. So not same. So Gopikas never knew that I am Parabrahm. With this conception, the neighbors uh, never, uh, never, you know, came to me to love me. Huh? Externally, Yogamaya, it, ex, externally it was the arrangement of Yogamaya. Everybody in the society feeling, those Gopikas, they have their husband. Of course, everybody they didn't have. There is some category. Some of them had husband, some of them without marriage, different kind of Gopikas. Anyway, so I am speaking just in general, but it, you know. For, so, they wanted to accept me wanted to accept me as hero, as hero, Parakiyabhav. 
And finally with this conception, they all were successful to reach me. I mean here I am speaking about the Sadhan Siddha. Here particularly I am speaking about the Sadhan Siddha Gopika. I am not speaking because when Krishna coming, that time some new, new Jivatma, they can get chance to take the form of Gopi Sarab, Sadhan Siddha. But I was discussing about Nitya Siddha, I, so long I was discussing, now Krishna speaking. So, they were all successful to reach me, Parabrahma Bhav, they got this Parabrahma Bhav. Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking, I mean our commentator speaking, as per Bhakti Rasamrita Siddhu, as per Bhakti Rasamrita Siddhu, we know, Adho Ushad Yaha Tataho Sadhu Sangha Atho Vajana Kriya Tato Anatha Nibhritihi Shvat Tato Nishtha Ruchis Tataha Atha Shakti Stato Bhavaha Stato Hu Prem Abhudan Chati Shadokana Mayam Prem No Padur Padur Bhave Bhavet Kramaha so our commentator are going to put this loka and speaking that in gradual course you can go up and up and up and finally you can get that either prema and after that anurag, anurag, very excellent stage. Seven, seven different kind of stages. Seven different kind of stages you will have to cross. Seven different kind of stages you will have to cross over and to reach up to that prema stage. And this kind of so those sadaka can reach up to that point. But those gopikas, they were taken in this Mahabhav. They were taken in Mahabhav, which is rare in this material world. Mahabhav, excellent, is impossible. This way Bhagavan Sri Krishna is speaking, Mat Kama Ramanam Jaro Sarupam Jaro Sarupo Bido Avala Brahmo Man Param Prapuhu Sangyat Shato Sahasrasa. Many of them, they were successful to reach me. Mat Kama Ramanam Jaro Sarupam Jab Jaro Sarupo Bido Avala. This way, they were all successful to reach me. Now finally Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking. Bhagavan Sri Krishna wanted to give some reminder to Uddhav because Uddhav wanted to hear all in details. Before you leave this material world, you please advise me. All Bhagavad Tattva began. All everything. So Bhagavan Sri Krishna naturally going to step by step speaking. When Bhagavan Sri Krishna was speaking, Uddhav, whatever I told everything, you all leave everything. Tashmad tam Uddhavo eh, utsrijyo chodanam prati chodanam prabhrittincha nibhrittincha sratabhyam srutab sutamevacha. Now I am going to advise you, whatever suti siti prabhritti nibhritti sratabho mane you need to do what not to do, all ever. I am going to advise you to leave everything. And only and only take shelter unto my lotus feet. That is final. Bhagavan says, like Gopikas. Because Gopikas never care any Ved, Vedanta, Suti, Siti, all rules and regulations laid down in society. They didn't care. So Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking to Uddhav, Tashmat Tashmatam Uddhava Utsrijo Chodanam Prati Chodanam Prabhitinchani Brittincha Satabyam Sutohomevacha. All you live. Whatever I told you for so long, Suti Siti Prabhiti Nibriti, whatever you uh, you uh, you are supposed to hear, eh, very important, all you can throw away. 
And the only object of Saranagati, the only object of Saranagati, the absolute object of Saranagati, and to my lotus feet you come. Now I say you leave everything. That's why Bhagavan Sri Krishna is speaking. Tasmatam Uddhavo Usrijo Chodanam Prati Chodanam Prabhritincho Nibhritincho Shatabhyam Srutamevacha. Then what to do after leaving? Huh? So long you, for a long time you are giving me advice, you will have to obey rules and regulation in Suti, Siti, whatever. Now you are seeking you all throw. Then where I can go? Bhagavan speaking. Mamekam eva saranamatmanam sarvadehinam jahi sarvatma bhavena maya sha hi akuto bhaiya. Only and only I advise you now, you will leave everything, the absolute object of saranagati, and to my lotus feet you come and take saranagati. That is the final advice to me. That is my final advice to you. Uddha speaking, uh, now I am in confusion because Sangsaya, Sangsaya, Sinnatu, Bacham, Tabu, Yogeshwara, Na, Nivartatu, Atmastu, Jeno, Brahmati, Me, Manaha. Now I develop different kind of doubts whenever you are speaking this. Sangsaya, Sinnatu, Bacham. After hearing all your advice at present, I am in confusion. You say to throw everything. But Uddhavji is going to address Krishna, Joge Swareswara, going to give consolation that Krishna is Joge Swareswara. So surely can, Krishna cannot speak, surely Krishna cannot speak a uh, uh, no, lie. All impractical things Krishna cannot speak. So, so, he wanted to give consolation to, come on, he is Jogeshwareswara. All the Jogeshwar, they are getting all power from Krishna. Like Mahadev, all they are getting in infinity. So, surely he cannot misguide me. That I am sure about. But, is going to express his doubt in front of Krishna, what to do. My, uh, my mind is fluctuating. I cannot realize. I have developed some doubts. Sang sayoho sinnato vachaho tabe tabo yoge swareswara na nivartato atmasto jena bhammati me manaha. Now I am not getting peace inside heart. I am feeling chanchal, restless. Why? Because my mind unstable. You are speaking this and that. Some, you already told me. To follow this and that, now you are speaking the same thing. What happened with Arjun? When Bhagavan Sri Krishna started explaining from first chapter, second chapter, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, going on, every time you are my dear, I am going to speak you this. So you do it. Are you are speaking this? Ultimately, Arjun could not be here. But what do you mean to say? Now you just told you do it. Now you should do it. What I can do? Tadei kang madanis chitam. Jeno sreo aham apnuat. You speak only one advice. It can be your advice is confusing. I cannot realize what to do. Eh? What I can do? You can speak only one so that I can get absolute benefit. So, Arjun was bound to speak. Tadekam madanishchitam jeno sreo aham apnuhat. So that I can get the absolute benefit. Then, Krishna was bound to say that you see, Arjun, finally, finally what, finally what, Arjun, Krishna told to Arjun, whatever advice I given, okay, okay, I leave. Sarva dharmanam parityajo mamekam saranam But so long you are advising, keeping you in front of me, keeping you in front of me, I was bound to give advice for the whole world, 
Because who knows in what position, in what position you are now. Your position I don't know in what position you are now at present. What position C is, V is all different position can be there. So I am bound to speak open. So first of all I start from survey. First of all, first chapter is the survey of the strategy. Shaina Darshan. First chapter is called the survey. It's going to survey who is there, what strategy. From second chapter, Bhagavan Sri Krishna started speaking, well, this body is nothing, you are going to leave, as Atma is everything, or oh, everything now starts. After that, Karma Yoga, eh? Gyan Yoga, Dhyan Yoga, Raj Guho Yoga, all oh, finally, oh my God. And finally, after coming to 18th chapter, Krishna speaking, you need not follow up. Sarva Dharmanam Parichaja Mamekam Saranam Bhaja. So the point is that keeping Arjun in front of, keeping Arjun in front, Bhagavan Sri Krishna wanted to give advice for all openly to all because who knows in what situation who is at present. One Jivatma in this condition, one Jivatma in this condition, countless Jivas. So according to their According to their sanskar, according to their sanskar, at least they can get the way out. According to their sanskar, they can get some way out. Karma yoga is also, but provided karma yoga can, there is so many things I already discussed in Gita promotion. Karma yoga also, like by karma yoga, gyan yoga, dhyan yoga, all different. But finally, Bhagavan speaking that. You forget everything, whatever I told. Man mana bhavo madhijaji man mang namaskuru. You think about me only. You worship me. You worship me everything. You pray pranam to me. So that is the same thing. Now Uddhavji Maharaj speaking. Sangsa yoho srinnato vach. Sangsa. Sangsayoho sinnato bacham tabo yoga svareswara. After hearing this kind of advice, I mean, I am in confusion. I cannot uh, feel any peace inside. So, so confusion. No nivartato atmosto jeno brahmati me manaha. My mind is now fluctuating. Then Bhagavan Sri Krishna began, Well, I know. But be sure, Uddhav. Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking, Uddhav cannot realize that I am all in all. Uddhav now in confusion. Though I know there is no such appropriate candidate like Uddhav, but now Uddhav in confusion. He thinking, uh, I can take shelter of Veda, Vedanta, everything or whatever you say only. So, Bhagavan Sri Krishna wanted to establish this fact that Uddhav, in infinity world, nothing there except me. That you forget. Because you love me. You, you have some friendship with me. So you forget. You forget that in infinity world, in Prakita, Aprakita, Jagat, whatever, wherever it is, all I myself. So why you are in confusion? What is called Veda, or I myself Veda. Bhagavan already told. Bhagavan already told in Gita. I am Veda Bid. I know Ved. Huh? I know the all the inner meaning of Veda. Everything I myself. Ishvara Socha Ishvara. Vedasya Ishwaratma Tvat Tatra Muihanti Surayo Bhagavan speaking to Uddhav, Ved and I myself non different. I am coming in the form of Veda. So, Rishi Muni is also, they are in confusion. They cannot understand the inner meaning of Veda. Even Rishi Muni is there in confusion. Vedasya Cha Ishwaratma Tvat Tatra Muihanti Surayo. They are in confusion to get out the inner meaning. 
So don't worry. Try to realize Uddhav, what is bed? I myself. Coming in the form of bed. Sha Esha Jiva Vivaro Prasutihi Praneno Ghosheno Guham Pravishto Mano Mayam Shuksham Upetta Rupam Matra Sharo Varno Iti Stavishtaha. Expression of Veda in different form. Bhagavan speaking, where from Veda come? We know from Brahma. From Brahma? Yes. From the four mouth of Brahma, from the four mouth of Brahma, Veda coming, Riksham, Joju, Atharva. But somebody is speaking this way. But Bhagavan speaking, in the original form of Veda, Veda was in very secret form. Para, Pashanti, Madhama, Vaikhari. Translation not possible. No father there in the universe who can translate. Para, Pashanti, Madhama, Vaikhari. They saw Skitra. Para I mean absolute. So when originally Veda was there, is resting here. There is some chakra here. So I am not going in details. Yeah. So Bhagavan speaking, this way, first of all, in original form, Krishna giving one example with fire. Krishna giving one example with fire. Uddhav, just like one wooden log, a long time lying in sunlight. So, surely you know, fire is there. Sunlight in the form of energy is there. Fire is there. Fire is there. But when two wooden log friction, try to understand. Bhagavan giving this example, Uddhav, how fire going to expressed? How fire going to get expressed? First of all, fire you can find in the form of dry, dry, dry logs. After that, some friction can be there. By friction, the dry log there, heat energy can be there. Friction means heat. This is heat. In winter season, you are drinking. So heat energy. So the heat. So first of all, wooden log, the friction there. So in the form of some heat, heat uh, they are developed. After that, they take some fine form of fire. Cha. Little. After that, the blow of wind, blow of wind going to give, give inspiration. I mean, going to go. Uh, the fire taking a huge form. By the help of fire, by the help of wind, that small amount of fire develop fast. But now it's taking a big, going to dry. Bhagwan going to speak. This four different kind of form. Except that you cannot realize if I go on speaking all the details about. So you try to realize Bhagavan speaking just like a, uh, just like dry wooden piece there. Fire is already there but not expressed. When first of all friction, then heat generated. After that, you to heat somehow some a uh, little bit of fire can char. After that, by the help of wind, it takes a big form. So, in original form, Veda is there resting here. After that, coming in the form of Vaikhari. Vaikhari means like word. In Vyakaran, if you read Vyakaran, it is written, Jiva Goswami Path Vyakaran also more practical, everywhere it is. But essentially, it is written, Ye o a ko kho, all everything, Narayana Udbuddha Varnakramaha. The first chapter, when you start reading Vyakaran, you will have to read, Narayana Udbuddha Varnakramaha, all Varna, A, O, A, Ka, Ka, not ABCD. ABCD is useless. I am not speaking every. 
all everything is coming indirectly, not directly, but it is written that all varna is coming from Narayan. Narayan was Buddha Varna Krama. After that, there is different grammatical rules and regulation and pronunciation, tongue. If you, if your tongue is pure, first of all, I told you will you will have to attain the Brahman stage. Vaishnava stage first you cannot go. First of all, you will have to come to the stage of Brahmanism, Brahman stage. So those who are develop, going to Brahman stage, their tongue becomes very fine, like halka, light. And Saraswati is sitting in their tongue, so they can speak freely. Saraswati is going to sit. Especially those devotees, pure devotees. The Saraswati is sitting there, so they are gone. Not they are, they are material lecture. They are passing some <laughs> material lecture, they are not doing. So, whenever Vedas coming from the mouth of Brahma, so realize this was the procedure. Finally coming and taking the form of sound. Vaikhari means sound, like I am speaking word. If I am not speaking word, if I am in, uh, keeping inside all my harikatha, then expressing, so it is fine form. Follow. Harikatha fine in fine form there inside me is coming out. So para pashanti madhyama baikari. You should realize this was the expression, step by step expression of Veda in the form of sound. In the form of sound, this way Vedas are expressed. Bhagavan going to speak this way. Also, Bhagavan already confirmed in Gita. Vedasya sarve rahame bhavidya. Giving the same example, Jatha analaha khe anilo bandhurasma baleno daruni Adhimatthamanaha onuhu prajayato havisha samidhate tathaiva me bhakti riyam hi bani. Iyam hi bani. That Veda bani coming in this form. What I explain? Bhagavan speaking to Uddha. Jatha analaha, just like a fire, jatha analaha khe anilo bandhurusma baleno daruni adhimatthamanaha Anuhu prajayato habisha samidhate eh, tathaiva me bhakti riyam hi vani. Bhakti means prakasvate, expression of Veda this way. This way gradually Veda become a subject of hearing, Veda become a subject of speaking, this way came. But originally it was in fine form. Be careful. So, Evam Gadihi Karmo Gatir Visargo Grano Raso Drik Sparsho Shutischa Sankalpa Vigyana Matha Bhimanam Abhimanaha Shutram Rajas Est Raja Raja Satta Tamo Vikaraha. Now Bhagavan is going to unveil the mystery of this creation, how people are how people are hypnotized. They are like magic. They cannot realize the Maya. Bhagavan now going to express in front of Buddha very clearly, Atta Vigya. In between, wanted to remind him that don't forget the love affair between Brajavasis and me, especially those Brajagopika. She wanted to, this is the heart. I would say, what I already told for two days, that is the heart of the whole advice given by Krishna to Uddha, but still, Tattva Vigyan is also important. Because without realizing Tattva Vigyan, you can never come out of Maya. People can speak big, big philosophy. People can recite big, big stotra. They can memorize. But realization is quite different thing. Realization not so easy. You can speak. You can memorize. But realization, 
Realization is impossible. Realization is rare. Whole world, if you can search, if you can make combo operation, one, two, three, who can be there? Realize, totally realize this point. Very rare. So, Bhagavan speaking, evam gatihi, evam gadihi, karmo gatir visargo grano raso drig sparsho sutischa. Shankalpa Vigyano Mathavimanam Shutram Rajaha Shatta Tamu Vikaraha. Uddha, be careful. People are doing something, people thinking something, people playing their brain, they are getting smell this way, they are looking, they are going to eh, going to leave stool and urine. All their activities, everything done by me. All they are doing, whatever they are doing. Bhagavan speaking, whatever they are doing, be careful, all done by me. I am there, that's why they are doing. Like in the body, pancha pran, bayu, all our, you cannot believe. If I go on speaking this way, all secrecy. How we are digesting our, we are taking prasadam, how digestion? There is also five bayus, apan, udan, saman, this all going to play their respective function. We are going to keep contact with outside world inside by respiration, exhalation, and inhalation. And we are keeping balancing this portion. There is one dipragam cell. There is one cells, there is one, there is one screen in between, upper portion, lower portion. The Pragham cell it is called. Follow. So upper portion is controlled by some wind and lower portion by other. She cannot understand. How possible? What is the technology of Bhagavan? If you are really, if you are really a if you are really enjoying Guru Kipa, actual Guru Kipa, then you can go mad. What is the technology of Bhagavan? What is the technology, excellent technology? All different parts, they are different, different colors, all aquatic elements, they are different design and shape, different. Oh, oh. Infinity diversity. How possible? Who is that Bhagavan? Who is going to make these different flowers with different fragments, smell? Oh, so nice. Padma, lotus, everything, you know, rose, all different kind of. Who is that Bhagavan? We are thinking our, about our technology. Oh, we are successful to send our mission. We are sending, launching one, you know, satellite up to a moon god. Hello, moon. This is called technology. But you think about the technology of Bhagavan. You are so idiot, foolish. You are only thinking, we are successful, scientific innovation, rascal. What you are doing? You think about the innovation of Bhagavan. What is the technology? Fine technology on the basis of which he is making all creation. How nice engineer Bhagavan. Eh? Only by desire Bhagavan doing. But we are foolish. Our eyes is really blind. I am bound to say, at least if your eyes is open, at least if your eyes is open, you can see something diversity. Like all, you know, they are not initiated, but they God association, Sadhus, Rai Rabindranath Thakur, Najur is some Muslim Kobi, Muslim. All they wrote something, which is really miracle. How they realize? They are not initiated. They got the association of Bhakti Thakur. They got the association of Prabhupada. They got the association of Rashikman Vidyabhushan. In my previous home, it was just next door. Just next door. But long ago, I am thinking about long ago, not today. So, how is possible for them to, to think so deeply? 
How it is possible for Einstein to think so deeply? What is, he is not initiated. My question is not initiated. He is not initiated. How is it possible for him to think so deep? Eh? You just think how possible? About time, about quantum theory, about theory of real. Oh, oh. Nobody can think how far reaching, deep. So if one scientist, of course he gone, he used to, of course Einstein used to go through a, a Gita daily, morning and evening, after coming back from college, I mean university. Study it. What is the fine technology? It is only known to those who are, those who are, you know, those who are really Sadhu Guru Vaishnav, they have this idea. Now how it was possible for Einstein to realize? How it was possible for Einstein to realize that the, any matter is a concentration of energy? It is their secrecy in our Veda. Agama, Purana, it is secrecy. But how it was possible for Einstein to realize? It is our secrecy. But he was the only person to realize that matter is a concentrated form of energy. Are it is written in our Veda, I mean, uh, Chandi part. Ya Devi Sarva Bhuteshu Shakti Rupena Sanastita Namasta Sway, Namasta Sway, Namasta Sway, Namo Namaha. Read it, Chandi part. That Devi Shakti, that the Bhagavad Shakti is there everywhere. Everywhere, anything you look, all, all everywhere, whatever you like, you see, all. Ja Devi Shakti, Ja Devi, eh? Shakti Rupena Sanstita. Ja Devi Sarva Bhuteshu. Sarva Bhut Mane? Everywhere, be it in the form of water, air, uh, space, light, whatever you think. Sarva Bhuteshu, all Bhuta, like if you make one solution of you know, sugar or salt, after if you are soluble, because solubility is there, water solubility, to, then you cannot find salt, you are gone. Salt only intermolecular space, gone, everything now you cannot see. So like this, this same Jagavalka Muni wanted to make understand. Jagavalka Muni wanted to see, wanted to say, like the solution. I am putting sugar, but where the sugar gone? Uh, sugar gone inside. Similarly, all the energy of Bhagavan, all you can find entered into each and everything. Even each, each and every your body cell, where not? All function going undisturbed way. Whenever your body function disturbed, when your when your cell division is disturbed, then the question of cancer can come. When unusual body cell division going on inside the body, then the question of cancer can come. Otherwise, cancer cannot come. How scientific our how scientific, excellent, our Vaishnav Bishar. It is written, Chapal Gopal speaking, doing all rubbish. After that, after that what happened? Some reaction going on. Chapal Gopal done some mistake, aparat, offense, and lotus feet of Sivasma. But he is now undergoing some unusual reaction inside body. Practically, you can show. You are now in fresh condition. No? You do some aparad. Then you are from your brain, from your brain some toxic element can come out. You do murder somebody and all, you do rape case, so many things you do. Then from your brain some toxic poisonous things are coming. Why people in tension, anxiety, developing different kind of disease, why Vaishnavas are feeling comfortable? Follow. So, in that case, all your 
body function disbalance, then you develop leprosy. Your body, blood, or some, something uh, emitting from your brain, and all your blood become contaminated, then you develop leprosy. Same, the, same case happened. When that Gopal Chakrabarti, when that Gopal Chakrabarti wanted to speak all rubbish to Haridas Thakur, the great Namacharya. Gopal Chakrabarti, the young Brahman boy, Brahman, young boy, he thinking I am Brahman, I know everything, but now what happens? What happened? Very dangerous. Within one or two days, within one or two days, Gopal Chakravarti is nose affected by leprosy and falling down. Because he told Haridas, you are emotional personality. Eh? He told openly in, 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 the, in the assembly, you are emotional personality. Eh? Eh, Jagya, Tapasya, Estreated Pinanza cannot do as that Harinam can do. Haridas told, why don't you believe? Why you don't believe? This is the power of Harino, I mean, it is Shastra. Ah! Then you will have to cut your nose. If you cannot prove, they will have to cut your nose, otherwise I can cut my nose. This way, he started argument, and the result was that within one or two days, he developed leprosy of hand, or your nose all fall down. Very nice nose. So practically, so our Vaishnav Darshan, I am thinking, how practical, how practical day and I am thinking, previously I was used to help those scientists, then I am thinking more practical. How our Shastra? So anyway, today I like to stop here. Tomorrow I can discuss all in details about what Bhagavan Sri Krishna wanted to speak to. And the sloka is started, I couldn't explain. Jat sakta yo vadatam vadinam vai vivad sangbad bhubo bhavanti kurvanti chaisham mohuratma moham tasmai namanant guna yubhumne Bancha kalpatur sikhi basindu vivach patitanan pavane bho vishna bhyo namo. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna. Krishna Krishna Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare Hare Hari Bol Hari Bol Hari Bol Hari Bol Hari Bol Hari Bol Hari bol, Hari bol, Tai Gaur Hari bol, Hari bol, Hari bol, Nitai Gaur Hari Hari bol, Vancha Kalpatur Sikh Bhagavan, Patitanang Bhavan Bhushnabhya.